Hey guys, welcome back. Today, I'll be showcasing Kilwa in a universal time. Before we begin, please like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. It's free and it really helps me out. Let's get straight into it. So, Kilwa has just released. I have just gotten it and this it seems to be really powerful. So, the first things first, the M1 combo. Does three hits and then knocks him back, all doing 33 damage. Get off the tree. As you can see, it launches you forward to keep up with your opponent that you're knocking back. Next is the Snake Awakens. You press the E key and it's like a barrage, but it's uncancelable, so it's really good. It does 65 damage. That's like one of the best barrages in the game. And it's got an extremely low cooldown. The next move is the R move, no mercy, you dash up to them and electrocute them for 35 damage. It's pretty good, it's just the dashing up to them that may be a little slow. The next move is the T move, you press T and it launches a lightning bolt or thunderbolt at your enemy doing 25 damage. This is thunderbolt again from the side. And the good thing about all these first three moves is they have a really, really short cooldown. As you can see, I can use Thunderbolt again. The next move is Rhythmic Echo. You can press Y to get all your copies and have a little bit of iframes. And it's got a short cooldown as well, so that's good. You can just bam. And you can also hold it down and aim to one of your clones to teleport to them or to replace them. So as you can see, I want to go to that one. I let go and it goes to that one. All with iframes on it. The next move is uh, instant death. You dash forward grabbing their heart doing 50 damage. This is instant death again. The next move is the H key, you press the H key, it's onslaught, you lean forward, teleport to your enemy, doing tons of damage. This is the onslaught move again. It has a knockdown or knockback in a random direction, so you don't always know which way your opponent will fling. The next move is the V move, you teleport a short distance forward. It's great for traveling and all that sort of stuff, but you cannot go through buildings, which is kind of sad. I'd really like for that to be a thing. The next move is the G move. It's God Speed, and it makes some of your moves that make you launch forward instantaneous. So you press G, you press G, your lightning, like the F move instantly teleports forward, has a bigger range. The R move instantly teleports forward to your enemy and all that sort of good stuff. And let's see the H move, no difference. So those do have a longer cooldown with Godspeed. So it has a couple give and takes. Godspeed also increases your jump height and the distance of your speed of lightning. It doubles both of them. So that's just a quick thing. And the last move is the Q key. You press the Q key, otherworldly aura, and then this happens, and you get a new aura around you, and you do heaps more damage, and you get extra defense as well. So, <laughs> it seems like this character is going to be really great for 1v1s and stuff. I mean, just look at this. If you enjoyed my video or found it helpful, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get notified when I make a new video. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time.